everybody. This is Chris from KRC Creations. I wanted to come to you and show you um, the product that I have been working on. Well, I haven't been working on it. I've been using this for a while. But I want to show you it. And it's my makeup remover. I've assembled some makeup here that I tend to find is so difficult to remove if you don't have a really good, you know, makeup remover. What will happen is you will think it's gone or you'll try your best, hurt your lids, whatever, and trying to get this stuff off. Um, it looks great when it's on, but when it's time for it to go, if you don't have a good medium to get rid of it, um, it tends to stay with you. So I want to show you how well I believe and this works, which is my makeup remover. Um, and I'm going to do some swatches of some of the things that I find are difficult to remove. This is... a uh, lip liner and oh my god this is a great lip liner because you don't have to line your lips the lipstick is gone before this is ever gone so let me do a swatch yeah, swatch right here of that and this is i don't know if you guys use this but this is gold <laughs> this is the nyx jumbo pencil and milk it's a great base and it helps your eyeshadows really pop so i use this but it's very hard to um get off so i'm gonna swatch this as well right here give a nice coating of that there and um one second my husband and son is coming upstairs they make a whole lot of noise. So, yeah, that's the Jumbo Pencil and Milk. Also, um, I have the, um, you hear them, I'm sorry. This is gel liner. I love using gel liner. So, it once you put it on, it tends to say exactly where you put it. Um, it doesn't run, but it just stays there. And I love that about gel liner. So I have a little swatch of that there. Also, this is waterproof mascara. As you know, any waterproof mascara takes a lot to get off. Um, because you don't want to hurt your eyes and things like that. So I'm going to show you. I'm going to put that right here. Some of that right there. I'm running out of that, but yeah. There you go. And this is liquid liner. You doing really dark stuff so you can see how well it works. The liquid liner, once it dries, it tends to stay put. I'm going to put some of that right there. There you go. And last, well not last, but um, this is the e.l.f. Eyelid Primer. It, it's it's it, you it does work it's as good as an urban decay primer potion as a primer it keeps your eyeshadows on where you put them and they stay all day um i really love this it's a dollar urban decay primer potions like 15 16 20 dollars somewhere around there um so i'm gonna put some of that right here that dry a little bit here's some of my shadows I'm going to put some red right there, right on top of this right here. Get a nice coating of that red right there. And all of this is dry. Let's dry that. There you go. Now all that is there. Now when I um, take my makeup off, uh, give me a minute. I have to get a tissue. Uh, Sorry about this. I, should, I was prepared before, but I'm not. Just use a little um, tissue here. I'm just going to take a little bit. Well, let me show you this first. This is the makeup remover. Plus, give this some time to dry. Um... And it's made with jojoba oil, which is really, really good for your skin. It's also made with beeswax because it, the beeswax helps the oil from sinking into your skin. So it gets to the dirt, the makeup, and just, you know, stays on top of your skin and wipes it right away. And it also has cocoa butter in it. Cocoa butter is really good for your skin. And it provides that slip so that it goes right on top of your face. 
and it's easy to remove. And um, the, ele the um, elements of the healthiness of cocoa butter, you guys know, it's just really an awesome thing. So this is um, my makeup remover. It comes in these two ounce jars. Um, I've been <laughs> working at this one for a while. You don't need that much at all. I'm going to show you just how little you need this, how, how little you need to get the um, makeup off. So I'm just going to take a little dab. That's all you need. That's pretty much it. And then just rub it over your makeup. You can see it's already gone away. Take your tissue and it just right wipes right off very easily and I'm not even um, wiping really hard so you know like delicate tissue of your eye around your eyes and things like that it just comes right off just like that and I just used a tiny tiny bit and it got all that just off and just a little swipe and it just leaves clean skin behind there you go so that is my makeup remover it's here and um, it works really well you saw it yourself and there you have it clean skin after that so yeah um, I'm gonna put some of this on my art fire if you're interested um, Everybody that I know that wears makeup at some point, I introduced this to them because you know how much even eye remover. And yes, you can put this on your eyes. It can get inside your eyes and it does not hurt, does not burn, does not sting, nothing. And it comes out and it doesn't leave a, a nasty film on your eyeballs or anything. I usually tell them about this because I know how hard it is. I wear a lot of eye makeup because I love eye makeup and I have almond eyes that um, I really <laughs> like to accentuate so I tell my friends or whoever I know that wear makeup about this and I tend to give them a sample and they use it and they fall in love with it too so um, I hope you guys like it um, so that is my makeup remover alright I'll see you guys later bye